Oh, you say, you know, I told you that lady be parking here, right? She haven't parked there since the last garbage day, right? And I'm gonna see if she do it today. Because if so, she doing that shit on purpose. Some people don't tip at all, but want to order stuff. You shouldn't be ordering nothing if you're not trying to tip. That's all I'm gonna say on that. Y'all see all this? I'm not never taking an order like that again. Shit get hectic over here. I'm not these other bitches, pretty bubble poison, baby. I probably kill a nigga Chucky on his best day. Don't got no feelings in me, won't your body? Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. You already know to subscribe below because you already know we're not begging. I got on this white lip gloss, stuff on my face. It's hot today. Well, right now we're about to head up to the um, office to see if they took this lock off my stuff. They asked that I pay my bill. Yes, I paid my bill. Today is the 13th. The bill's been paid, so we better go up to the office, make sure this thing off. The lady seemed like she didn't have no type of authority, for real, when she was talking to me. When I tell her, like, it seemed like she had no way of checking on her computer, but we about to go up there and we about to see. Enjoy the video, y'all. Close the door. Okay. Let me see. You know I told you that lady be parking here, right? She haven't parked there since the last garbage day, right? And I'm gonna see if she do it today. Cause if so, she doing that shit on purpose. She haven't parked there since last week. They on the flat. They on the flat. Oh. storage got this lock on it and the lady in the office she always leave right when it's time for um when they know they about to close be out here stealing time and shit her ass then left from the damn office because I y'all not got track that I paid on the first like I do I have been doing every month. The first of the month is when it's due. Hmm. Look at that. Some lock color cutters. It don't look like I see the lock on there. Let's just see. Oh, they took it off. Cause they know damn well they made a damn mistake. Pissed me off. So now I'm about to go in here real quick and see when the last day I've been here. Cause I know I've been here. Of course, this date wrong, but I was here on the second. So 
today is the and this is how i keep track that's how i know the last time i've been here was the second so in between that time they had to have like my um storage we're gonna take all this other gum up out of here some new gum so we're about to take all that gum with us oh, some pretty lip glosses I don't wipe them off y'all saw that video I gotta finish making the other ones It's the two-tone. I ran out of one. I'm going to take this for me. That's the best part about having your own business. Take some inventory for you. Some stuff has fell. I got to stock up on some more water. I told y'all to stock up on y'all stuff. We about to head out. Y'all about to see me. I got some more vlogs and stuff coming. So y'all stay tuned for that. And we're going to catch y'all in the next clip. I'm at the gas station get my daughter a slushy and she got her some ice cream. Which one did you get? Um, a large, a large. vanilla. Sweetie. Oh, okay. That looks yummy. And a slushy. <laughs> That was only like 18.73 was the total for the order. And that's why you pay attention to the orders you get and how many items. Cause I can't, you know, when I'm girl with DoorDash, you know, I can make that in no time. I can at least knock out, um, in 30 minutes, I can knock out two like girl pub orders. But you know, I'll be, I'll be doing double, getting double my cash. I'm gonna tell y'all how I do that. So, getting double your cash. And you know, something else pop up, I might take it. It depends, it's still light out here. My husband not with me, so I'm a, I got my daughter with me, so we will not be out here too long. I might take one more. But I unlocked the um to deliver prescriptions. I rather take that than trying to go shopping for somebody. Come on, I rather do that. Cause right now I can actually pull up my grub up too. Yeah, so that was 18, y'all heard me right, 1873. I don't know if they took off something because of the lady, but y'all people that's getting y'all groceries delivered, anything over 50 items, $15 tip. $15, oh for real, $15 tip. Her tip was, okay, it was $13. Some people don't tip at all, but want to order stuff. You shouldn't be ordering nothing if you're not trying to tip. That's all I'm gonna say on that. Now DoorDash, that's kind of in Grubhub, that's kind of different because you um, ordering food. At least leave a five, six dollar tip. Don't just not tip. Cause if you if you can't tip, you gotta you ain't got no business ordering food. That's all I'm gonna say. So I'll let y'all know if something pops back up. Then we gonna wrap our our stuff on up. I could open my grub up too, but you know I prefer grub up because this me shopping for people. No, I be getting some um good orders in the house. I'm gonna see, but I ain't gonna take no orders. And you gotta pay attention. That order was right around the corner though. You gotta pay attention to the mom. Um, to the amount of miles you are driving.
driving. So that was nothing for me to drive, you know, that amount of miles. You feel me? So I told y'all that was almost two hours of doing that. But, you know, to be honest, I'd rather do that than have to punch somebody's clock. So we basically gonna say we made $9 an hour today. You know? We made $9 an hour today. Which ain't bad, cause I ain't had to do nothing but look for some stuff. It was actually kind of fun. It made me think to those who are older, um, shoppers, what is it? Shopper suite? Well, like I said, if I was in a more comfortable store and not in a small Highland Park, I was in Highland Park, Michigan, all these, to those who know Detroit, that's right on Woodward. And that boy is small. And like I said, them shelves was looking mighty empty. Y'all better stock up on y'all food. Y'all think I'm playing with y'all. Like I said, if you ain't got no garden or no land, you gotta, it's time to stock up on some food. And you know, that's, that's, that's a couple of things I'm working on. You ain't, ain't gonna say too much. Stock up on your food. Stock up on some water. Cause some shelves about to get empty. You know how the government do. They be causing food shortages and stuff. We ain't gonna get started on that. They the cause, they the problem. Y'all see all this? I'm not never taking an order like that again. This is my first order though, so I ain't tripping. And then I'm in a like a ratchet neighborhood. So people was walking out left to right, all up on my back. I don't like crowded places. I just don't. So as you can see, all of this, and guess how long it took me, y'all? Just put it in the comments. When I tell you, I'm used to all these. All these is not the problem. But this, all these, they shit was scattered everywhere. I told you, that pandemic, y'all better get y'all some food. A man fucked around and fell in love. All man silly.